Another phenomenon that emerged in the 1950s was the mysterious men in black, or MIB. According to ufologists, these men were agents of a secret government organization that was tasked with investigating and covering up UFO sightings and encounters. Some, however, believe that these mysterious men may be another manifestation of otherworldly phenomena. The first reported sighting of the men in black occurred in 1952, when a UFO researcher named Albert Bender claimed to have been visited by three men in dark suits who warned him not to continue his investigations. Over the next few decades, more and more people claimed to have encountered the men in black. They described the men as intimidating and threatening, and they claimed that the men would visit them and try to persuade them to stop their UFO research. The men in black became a popular subject in ufology, and many people believed that they were a real and powerful organization. Some even claimed that the men in black were not human at all, but were actually extraterrestrial beings in disguise. Others believe they are interdimensional beings traveling between parallel universes and dimensions. But one thing is certain, the men in black are not to be trifled with. They are cold, calculating, and utterly ruthless in their pursuit of their mysterious agenda. Their appearance is always the same, tall gaunt figures dressed in dark suits and sunglasses. They are said to move with a strange otherworldly grace, and their eyes seem to burn with an inner fire. Many who have encountered the men in black speak of their otherworldly demeanor, their strange mannerisms and behaviors. They are known to ask for a glass of water, only to pour it over their hands and rub it into their skin. They are rumored to take strange pills on a regular schedule, presumably to help them cope with Earth's atmosphere. But perhaps the most unnerving thing about the men in black is their utter lack of empathy. They seem to care nothing for the lives and well-being of the humans they encounter, treating us like mere insects in their grand cosmic scheme. Some argue that the men in black were a product of mass hysteria and fear, but others insist that they're not only real, but dangerous.